It's recording. And it looks like we can start the video. Hey, let's cheek lay chat about it. Cheek lay? Oh man, I'm excited. Welcome to Cheek Lay Chat. I'm Alex Gum, aka Cheek Lay, and this is season three. Okay, you have no idea how excited I am for this season. I have been planning a lot of different things and added some new stuff with this channel and talked to people and I'm excited what's about to happen. I got a new camera and I'm planning on doing a new editing system called Vegas Pro. We're not using the Adobe Premiere Pro anymore. You're going to see some awesome things with this new program. Then we have a lot of things that are happening with this channel and I want to discuss to you guys seeing what approach we're doing with this channel and then I'll talk about like a little bit about what's going to be happening outside of the channel. Jiggly Chat's going to be the exact same thing. It's going to be every Friday like always. Only this time we're kind of switching up depending on the week of the month. So let's just say week one, two, three, and four. Okay? These guys are going to stay the same. It's just going to be like a random video. Okay? Now, what's going to happen is on the second week of the month on Jiggly Chat every Friday, is that we are going to be doing a new thing which I like to call dance bios. And dance bios is where we're going to take some time to discuss about a biography of a very famous dancer, whether in the past or the present. I would kind of do the future, but that'd be kind of too much work and that'd be kind of impossible to do. So past and present it is. After doing some research we on a dancer that I choose to do a biography on, I will be talking about that dancer and on that same day, on Cheek Lay Productions Instagram account, you want to check out the story because there's going to be a voting poll. So you guys get to vote for either one or two. And uh, depending on the percentage, then I'm going to be picking on based on the percentage. And this is only just on Cheek Lay Productions Instagram. Not mine, just Cheek Lay Productions. So if you haven't followed Cheek Lay Productions on Instagram, I'm going to write out what it is, it's going to be at, that's the worst at sign ever, going to be cheek lay underscore productions. Make sure that you guys follow that on Instagram because that is how you're going to decide which dancer you want me to do a bio on to discuss about and all that stuff. And then on the last week, every last Friday of the month, is a new thing that I'm getting everybody excited for. I talked to a few people about this new thing. It is called Cheek Lay Chat Takeover. Cheek Lay Chat Takeover is like SNL. There's always a new host, and I don't know if they like do whatever they want because I think they're directed to do it, but whoever's hosting Cheek Lay Chat gets to do whatever they want. They could do like tips and advice, they could teach you how to play a piano, they could do a challenge video, they could just have like a chance to document something, they could do whatever they want. And I get to be behind the camera helping out a little bit, or actually in the last couple of videos that we recorded, they had me include in the videos, which they didn't have to, but it was really nice of them to do so. So Cheek Lake Chat Takeover is completely different than any other Cheek Lake Chat episode, because not only they're taking over the show as a host, but they get to do what they get to do best. And I believe that since everybody has a lot of different talents and that everybody is just themselves, I thought this would be a great opportunity to share the spotlight on them. They get to take charge, they come up with their own content, it gets recorded, and then it gets posted on Cheekly Chat Takeover, so we get to recognize a special guest once a month. Well, that's kind of the outline of what it kind of looks like with Cheekly Chat, but that's not the only thing that we're doing. We're bringing back Cheekly News Entertainment, we're bringing back the Motivational Mondays on Instagram, and we're actually going to be bringing back a couple dance videos. And if you guys have been checking out my YouTube channel, you've probably seen a couple notifications on your YouTube um, subscription, and some of you guys have been watching my channel in between December and now, and that's because I've been posting videos on something that is Pokemon Go related. If you guys remember in season finale of season 2 back in December, I discussed about how I recently been posting Pokemon Go videos. How, you know, I just play Pokemon Go and just go on adventures as always. And I had a lot of people liking that and I got more subscribers from that and I decided to do a separate show from Cheek Lake Chat and call it Pokemon Go Ahead. I'm trying not to do much of that as I usually do just because I have to like finish up with school is that it's like halfway through the semester so I'm trying to get that done I'm also in the process of doing a lot of tech for a show and 
I'm also trying to focus more on the content that I originally have started with this channel in the first place. But I'll still post maybe like one or two Pokemon Go videos, depending on the events that are going to be happening and stuff, but not too much. Now let's talk about what's happening outside. I mentioned about trying to get my classes done for the Associative Arts. I'm still working. But the one thing I really want to discuss about, I'm going to do a video on this later on, but I'm going to go take you guys behind the scenes for this show. That's right. If you see this dude right here, that is your boy, Alex, and he's going to be playing Cosmo Brown in West of the with your company, Singing in the Rain. So you guys are going to see me do a behind-the-scenes video. I mean, when I'm in a show, you obviously know we're going to vlog a behind-the-scenes, right? Come on. I'm not that crazy. Although, I don't know if I'm going to get a lot because I know I'm going to be on stage for the majority of the time. And I don't know how crazy they are going to be with the, you know, the tech and stuff. But, you guys should still check out the show. More details about it, make sure to check out how you get your tickets on this site right here. It saves me some time. I really don't have to do some texting on the screen. I just put it on the whiteboard. But anyway, guys, that's where you have to go to get your tickets. They're probably like about this much. So just get your tickets before they're selling out or they sell out. I think one of the shows is sold out, but don't, don't quote me on that. I don't know my facts. All you need to know is that you gotta buy a ticket to see the show. And that's all I want to talk about. And uh, make sure you guys stay tuned for next week for the first ever dance bio. We're going to be discussing about Gene Kelly. He's going to be our first dancer bio. And then on that same day that I post the video, make sure you guys check out Chicklet Productions' Instagram because there's going to be a voting poll on two dancers who you're going to find out later who, who you think I should do a bio on. So make sure that you vote because your vote matters way more than the presidential elections. And uh, subscribe to this channel for more stuff. And uh, with that being said, guys, I think we're really set for season three. I'll see you guys later. Wah! If you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, you can like us on our Facebook page. And be sure to follow us on Twitter and Instagram for more dance videos, more Chicklet Chat vlogs, more Chicklet News and Entertainment, and more content.